Hey, Disruptoid, it's Holly Bennett. I've just seen a completely awesome game and I'm absolutely psyched for it. Lollipop Chainsaw, this is the first time anyone's seen it. Thank God they've shown it here at Gamescom. Um, obviously, we're on Studio 51. He couldn't be here, but we've done a pretty good job anyway, I think. Yes, I hope so. I mean, you tell me. <laughs> no, it's fantastic. We've seen some gameplay, which was an even bigger deal. They haven't just shoved a trailer in front of us either. So let's just start with, first of all, story, girl. Julia looks hot, has a chainsaw. Yes, Juliet, our heroine. She's a zombie hunter. She is trying to figure out why zombies have come to San Romero High. She's actually kind of pissed off about it. Um, usually she's upbeat, easy going. She's idolized at her school. Everybody loves her. Maybe a couple that don't. But she's still trying to figure out why this zombie infestation has taken over San Romero High. Now let's talk about gameplay, because it looks really fast-paced, it's really quick, it, the gore is over the top, but the cute is over the top as well. I mean, it's clearly a pseudo game, but you know, is that what we're going for, fast-paced action? Absolutely. I mean, you, the faster the better. I mean, it's, it's hard sometimes because we're trying to slow the team down. It's like, we're going too fast, time out. Um, you know, it, it is cool. We do have a couple different attacks. We have our chair attacks, which is actually slower. Um, you know, you use your pom-poms and you can push and manipulate the zombies around. It doesn't do much damage. However, you can set up big attacks and do big decapitations, which give you big bonuses and rewards. Um, now the story, obviously, people look at it and think, okay, it's cute, it's going to be giggly and fun, but actually there's um, some pretty big names behind this, music and story-wise. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, music, I mean, I'm a fan of everybody that's attached to this, it's weird. <laughs> um, so, Suda51, uh, Grasshopper Manufacturer, really wanted to make a story, a zombie story. Suda has been all over, I want a zombie game, I want a zombie game. Uh, so he had a bunch of scratch paper, had a, all these ideas, and he really wanted to have a story that hit a huge amount and everybody could really connect with. So what other than to go after James Gunn, somebody that's known for over-the-top movies, and that's just totally insane. And both of them melded so well together. I was kind of worried at first. I was like, are these two going to be able to you know, do it without changing stories or you know, getting all crazy and weird? And no, they melded. They came together, they wrote the story, and then we began development. And sound? Sound. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you for reminding me. Akira Yumoka, not only a huge fan, uh, I'm so happy you know, to be working with him. Uh, he, it wasn't represented in the demo today because you know, it's a little bit different. Silent Hill's not as poppy, and Shadows of the Dam <laughs> isn't quite as glammy. So what is he going to be doing for this game? And uh, I can't wait to show everyone, or everyone listening. No, we're um, going to keep track of this game so much. I'm absolutely thrilled by it. Thank you so much for your time. Uh, Distracted, I keep watching the front page.